Hello, good morning guys. Uh, ang ato ang topic karon is how to uh, apply as a nurse in the UK if you are from the Philippines. So, ang mga requirements are the following. Hello guys, for our initial registration, it's very important na meron tayong mga uh, documents na kailangan i-prepare para hindi ka na magbalik-balik. Kasi kailangan nila malaman na you really exist at saka you really are a nurse, you are a nurse sa Pilipinas. So, ang kailangan mo actually pag nag-upload ka doon sa initial registration is yung passport mo. Kasi of course, that is your identity. Tapos, yung second mo na i-upload is yung uh, yung registration as a nurse that you are actually registered as a nurse tapos you are qualified uh, so you kailangan mo yung um, PRC mo, yung transcript mo yung diploma mo so i-upload mo yan siya doon for initial registration para makita nila na you are actually nilang eligibility assessment So, may mga i-upload pa kayo actually sa NMC yung iyong um, health evidence, yung character evidence, at saka yung IELTS mo of course, at saka you have to pay 153 pounds uh, as a registration fee. Tapos i-assess nila yung application mo uh, within 30 days. But first, uh, you have to inform actually yung iyong GP na nag-apply ka sa UK para hindi sila mabigla na may mga email sila from the NMC na to confirm you are uh, uh, of good um, health in order to work. Uh, 
pag nasa actually pag nasa uh, website kayo actually pag nag-start na kayo ng application on the right side merong step 1, step 2, step 3 at saka step 4. Kung ipo-follow mo yun siya, hindi kayo mawawala kasi nandoon lahat yung mga instructions kung ano yung mga next step niyo na gagawin. So it's pretty st- straightforward siya. So actually guys, it's very um, easy to actually and straightforward to go in the UK to work as a nurse. Ang very important lang talaga na isipin is uh, uh, gagawin mo at iisipin mo at purpublimahin mo is actually to take the IELTS which is their English English exam at saka yung kanilang computer-based test initially. So, in order for you to become a nurse, you need to pass yung kanilang CBT at saka yung OSCE. Yung part 1 is the CBT na pwede mong gagawin sa Pilipinas. Yung part 2 is gagawin mo yun when you already arrive in the UK. Meron naman silang mga um, mga review center and they will help you with the review para sa OSCE mo, para mapasa mo yung OSCE. And usually, all of the ta- most of the time, sila yung nagbabayad talaga. Actually, wala pa akong alam na ikaw yung magbabayad ng iyong OSCEs na exam. Pero sila lahat nagbabayad. At saka, ni ni reimburse nila yung mga ginastos mo sa Pilipinas. So, you have to keep the receipt. So, yan lang muna for uh, today. And I hope <laughs> nakatulong ako sa mga information. Tapos, kung may mga tanong kayo, please leave me a message um, and um, I will get back to you as soon as I can and I will give you some tips also for the next um, video I will tell you why I choose uh, UK and why I stay there but ngayon nandito na ako sa Germany but I will tell you why I love it there and uh, not in other countries of course it really depends kung ano yung gusto mo ano yung priorities mo at uh, saka yung mga plans mo so, and I hope to see you next time. And thank you for watching. Hello guys, uh, pahabo lang. Uh, just to remind you na pag nag-apply kayo sa agency sa Pilipinas, uh, hindi po kayo magbabayad ng any placement fee for for the agency kasi they are helping you uh, find a job in the UK. Hindi na po uso yan. Noon, you have to pay a placement fee but now it's not allowed. Tapos po, and if you have any questions, you can drop me an email. I will put my email on, on the link below. And at the same time, uh, if you have any questions, uh, don't hesitate to um, ask. Also, I wish you all the best sa inyong application as a nurse in the UK and I really hope that I was able to help you and and give you some information. Thank you so much.